How do you format a USB drive on Mac? It can be an SD card or with a reader or a USB stick or something of that sort. The first thing you want to do is open the USB drive and here you can see we have some data. So how do you clear this data out? So even if you uh, delete some of it, it's going to go into the trash. You can't necessarily see the trash on the uh, USB stick, but it does occupy some data. So to avoid that, what you want to do is go to applications. Here you have an option for applications. You can also go to applications through uh, the finder. So you don't necessarily have to open the USB drive. In finder, you have an applications tab. So in the applications tab, you want to move down to utilities. Here you can see the utilities. So double click on utilities to open it. And here you have disk utility, which you want to again open. In disk utility, you can see two drives here. One of them is uh, the internal drive that is present in the laptop itself. And the other one is the external drive, which is going to be our pen drive or whatever USB stick that you have inserted. So when you want to erase the pen drive or whatever USB stick that you plugged in, you have an option to erase here to click on that. Once you click on that, you will be asked to rename the files. For example, I'll name this drive and then you can change the format here so you can either do xfat or ms dos but for now we'll keep it xfat so that it's compatible with windows as well as mac and then you have an option to erase so click on that you can see erasing disk and creating drive so drive is in the inverted commas because it's going to be the new name for the drive there so it's done erasing the drive and it's renamed it so we'll click on done here you can see the name has been changed to drive even if I close it, even here on the home screen, the name is drive. So if I open it, there's nothing in it. So it's been formatted. It's been formatted to X fat. So yeah, that's quick and easy to format a drive on Mac. If you like the video and you find it informative, please like, share and please subscribe to my Mac talk.